First of all, I want to salute the workers at Tara Mines who have mounted a protest uh, today. The way that they are being treated by their employer, Belyden, is horrendous. They are facing shortly the loss of their jobs, the loss of their uh, wages, uh, the huge impact that, that will have on their community. That is supposedly temporary, but they are not being given any date uh, or even time frame for when the mine will be back in operation. Tower mines have been profitable over the past uh, 13 years. Uh, no real justification has been put forward by the company uh, for this. The question is, what is the government going to do to support these workers? Will you put pressure on the company to continue the mines in operation with full wages for the workers? And if they don't, will you heed the call from Unite and others to take Tower Mines into public ownership in order to ensure that jobs are protected, skills are protected, you, and Deputy. to retain this vital natural asset. Um, the option of taking into public ownership is not on the agenda, um, uh, uh, Dep Deputy. Um, but our major concern is with the impact of staff and their families, and this includes 650 staff who are employed directly by the company in Navin, but also staff and companies impacted which have contracts with um, Tara Mines. And Minister Coveney met the management team from Tara Mines last week. Uh, the Department of Enterprise, Trade and Employment and Officials and Enterprise Ireland, the ag or, or agency, uh, are engaging with the company to, to try and work out what assistance can be given um, to, to introduce efficiencies, reduce costs, including energy costs within state aid um, pr parameters. So every effort has been made to see what we can do um, to, to try and get Tara Mines reopened. Um, and also, uh, we, Ms. Coveney met with the trade unions uh, on Monday afternoon. We're very conscious of Thank their you. concerns, uh, and the WRC um, meeting this week. Deputy Noel, please. Yeah,